nature, the gentlest mother, impatient of no child, the feeblest or the waywardest, her admonition mild. In forest and the hill, by travelers heard, restraining rampant squirrel or too impetuous bird. How fair her conversation, a summer afternoon, her household, her assembly, and when the sun goes down, her voice among the aisles incites the timid prayer of the minutest cricket, the most unworthy flower. When all the children sleep, she turns as long away as will suffice to light her lamps. Then, bending from the sky, with infinite affection and infinite care, her golden finger on her lip will silence everywhere.